Navigate with confidence, mastering directions in English. Hello everyone, and welcome to today's video. We're going to dive into the world of English language learning, focusing on conversational English. Today's special topic is all about giving and receiving directions and we are going to learn how to ask for help with a navigation app. This is something we all encounter in our daily lives and being able to communicate these situations confidently in English is a great skill to have. So, let's get started. First things first, we need to understand the basic terminology that is commonly used in navigation apps. Terms like destination, route, GPS, navigate, and directions are used frequently. Understanding these words and phrases will allow you to communicate effectively when asking for help. Destination, the place that someone is going or where something is being sent. Route, a way or course taken in getting from a starting point to a destination. GPS, short for Global Positioning System, a system that helps determine geographical location. Navigate, to find the way to get to a place when you are traveling. Directions, instructions that tell you how to get to somewhere. Practice saying these words out loud and using them in sentences. The more you use them, the more comfortable you'll become. Now that we've got our vocabulary down, let's focus on how to ask for help. The first thing you'll want to do when you're asking for assistance is to politely grab the person's attention. Starting with a phrase like, excuse me, or can you please help me, is a good start. Here are some examples of how you can ask for help. Excuse me, can you help me set the destination on my navigation app? Can you show me how to find the best route on this app? I'm having trouble understanding how to navigate with this app. Could you assist me? How can I change the directions to avoid highways on this app? Remember, practice makes perfect. Try to make these sentences your own by changing the destination or the type of route you're asking about. Equally important to asking questions is being able to understand the responses and instructions you receive. People may use different terms when explaining, so it's crucial to familiarize yourself with some common phrases. Here are a few examples. First, enter your destination in the search box. The app will show the quickest route based on current traffic. To navigate, just follow the voice commands or visual cues on the map. If you want to change the directions, go to Settings and select Avoid Highways. Listen carefully, and don't be afraid to ask for clarification if you don't understand something. You might say something like, Could you repeat that, please? Or, Could you explain that in a different way? And that's a wrap. We've learned how to ask for help with a navigation app and how to understand the responses we might receive. Practice these phrases, customize them to your needs, and you'll be navigating your English conversations with confidence in no time. I hope this video has been helpful, and as always, happy learning. Keep practicing and stay tuned for our next video. See you then.